Welcome to Junior Achievement and thanks for your interest in being a JA volunteer. In this short video, we'll talk about the logistics before, during, and after a JA in a Day event. We'll cover everything from your arrival at the school, what to wear, what to bring, and more. Let's get started. JA recommends wearing business casual clothes or clothes that might represent your company, such as a work approved shirt with your company logo on it. You'll be on your feet for several hours, so you might also want to wear appropriate yet comfortable shoes. Finally, JA recommends dressing in layers. That way you can be prepared if you get too hot or too cold in the classroom. Check with your local JA area representative for any other specific instructions or recommendations. The most important items to bring with you are your JA materials. This might include a kit with program pieces, printed handouts or guides, personal technology like a tablet or cellular device for accessing a digital version of the volunteer guide, and any other items needed to effectively deliver your program. Don't forget to pack the JA in a Day guide for volunteers and teachers, which will guide you through each lesson. When you're prepping for the day, refer to the guide for volunteers and teachers to sort the materials and review content in order of the sessions to help your day run smoother. While reviewing the guide, go ahead and highlight, circle, or write personal notes to prepare for the lesson. Adding personal and professional examples that relate to the content will help the students connect the real world to the classroom. Alternatively, if you prefer to access and use the electronic version of the guide, don't forget to bring your tablet or device. Also, know your login credentials for JA Connect in order to access and use the digital supplemental materials. In terms of personal items, you might want to bring a water bottle with you and or a snack. Even though most schools have water fountains, it's always a good idea to be prepared. We'll talk about lunch options in just a moment. A timing device, such as a watch or phone, can also be helpful to keep you on track with the day's schedule and to time student activities. If you haven't already submitted it by the time you're ready to teach, you'll want to bring along any forms that your local JA area representative has provided. Most importantly, the JA Volunteer Conduct Standards form and the JA Social Media Policy. You may choose to bring a small prize or treat for the students. If you do, be sure to get it approved by your teacher beforehand and make sure to bring individually packed treats and avoid major allergens such as peanuts. JA recommends bringing a few extra as student numbers often change from the initial information provided by the school. JA also recommends bringing the same item to give to all students versus giving students choices. This helps to eliminate hurt feelings and the competition for prizes. If you're running late or get lost, call your local JA area representative or the school. The school phone number is usually provided by the local JA area with your volunteer materials. You may also get an email with the contact information. You'll also want to let your company coordinator know of your delay, especially if you cannot get a hold of your JA representative. If you're no longer able to participate as a volunteer, please contact the local JA area office as soon as possible so that they may recruit a replacement or develop another plan for that class. Lunch may or may not be provided at the school. Your local JA area representative will inform you prior to the day whether you should bring a lunch or if it will be provided at the school or by a sponsoring company. During the lunch period, you may be invited to eat with the students, but most of the time you'll spend your break in the teacher's lounge or in the class preparing for the next lesson. To learn more about JA in a Day events, please watch the JA in a Day What to Expect video found on JA USA's YouTube channel under Volunteer Resources, or contact your local JA staff representative. JA in a Day events are fun and fast-paced. There is a lot of activity, but it's a rewarding experience for volunteers, teachers, and students. In this video, we covered how to prepare for your program, the importance of reviewing the guide for volunteers and teachers, 
pre-sorting your JE materials, reviewing technology components, packing personal items for your day, dressing appropriately and comfortably, discussing snacks and treats with your teacher, notifying the school and JA if you're running late or unable to teach your JA class. We hope you enjoy your JA volunteer experience. If you have additional questions, you can always reach out to your local JA area representative. For more information about specific JA programs or to locate the JA area office closest to your location, please visit www.juniorachievement.org. As a Junior Achievement volunteer, you're part of a network of more than a quarter of a million volunteers who impact nearly 5 million students across the USA to own their economic success. Junior Achievement USA gratefully acknowledges Fidelity Investments for their dedication to the development of additional training resources for JA volunteers. Junior Achievement appreciates its partnership with Fidelity Investments to inspire and prepare young people to succeed in a global economy.